Attorneys for Michael Cohen and President Trump asked the judge not to give investigators documents seized by the FBI until they could review them and, citing attorney-client privilege, protect the identity of other Cohen clients. But the judge denied the motion and outed one high-profile client, conservative Fox News commentator and Trump supporter Sean Hannity. Hannity says he discussed real estate issues with Cohen, who's an old friend. Attorney Michael Cohen is the one under investigation in the proceedings taking place here in the federal courthouse in Manhattan. But it's the possibility that new information could come to light from those seized documents about President Trump and his alleged affair with a porn star that's attracting so much attention. Investigators are looking for possible criminal activity surrounding Cohen's $130,000 payment to Stormy Daniels, who says she was paid to keep quiet about her brief 2006 relationship with the president. My attorney and I are committed to making sure that everyone finds out the truth and the facts of what happened, and I give my word that we will not rest until that happens. She is suing Trump for defamation of character, and her lawyer says the seized documents could be important to their case and dangerous to anyone who's dealt with Cohen. He is radioactive. Anyone that had any contact with this man in the last 20 years should be very concerned about what secrets of theirs are within these documents. The judge has yet to decide who will review the documents, which include information about the president's business, before they're given to investigators. Cohen's attorneys have asked for the appointment of a so-called special master to do the job. They're typically an independent lawyer who decides what prosecutors can see. But prosecutors argue Cohen doesn't need these special protections, regardless of who he represents. Kristen Salumi, Al Jazeera, New York.